All right, everybody, let's see if we can get this campaign wrapped up. Um, late October 1815. This campaign actually does have an end date, and it's um, the end of December 1815. Of course, um, in real history, the French were already out of the Iberian Peninsula by this time. But we haven't managed to do that in this campaign. Or I should say I haven't managed to do it. Um, Right, we're out of money. Uh, we're not going bankrupt anymore, but we are out of money. We don't think we have anywhere that we can tax, do we? Yeah, we're probably going to lose this one, aren't we? Because it's um, going more French. Because they've got a whole bunch of agents in there. Um, they've still got four. Yeah, so we taxed it. I mean, we'd get more money. But at this point, yeah, who knows? Who knows? Right, this one is actually a rebel settlement. So is that. What we need is troops up here. That's what we need because we basically have to go and attack um, Toulouse. Right, I mean, we might as well go for it. Might as well go for it. Can't quite reach him. Alright. End of the turn. Now I am still looking for an overhaul mod. Um, that we can do. Alright. So 3,300. They do outnumber us. And better quality. A whole bunch of heavy cav. Um, Swiss units. Young guards, lots of grenadiers. Right, what's in there? Ah, uh, contra guerrillas. Also, lots of Polish units. More grenadiers, more artillery. Well, let's have a big battle. Let us have a big battle. If we're going to go out, we might as well go out with something rather cinematic. And the battles do look pretty good in Napoleon Total War. So if anyone has a recommendation for an overhaul mod, I know Darth Mod will probably pop up. Um, Napoleon Total War 3 is excellent if you're doing multiplayer. don't really know how that works out as far as um, campaign. Uh, let me guess, we can't even get off the side. Yeah, there's the border. And there's the border. Oh, it's going to be one of these weird ones. You know, we can't even deploy. Yep. We've got Vanguard deployment, and it doesn't do us a, a bit of good. Absolutely no good. Alright. Well... Might as well just start and uh, wait for the enemy to come. Come with all their reinforcements. I see some coming in all the way out here. Right. I guess we should redeploy. Hmm, the rest of them are coming from our front. Alright. That unit is racing towards my general. I can't see any units out here on this flank. Here he is. Yep, yeah, can't see anyone out here. Pretty much just going to redeploy the whole army, I think. Hmm.
Those ones should be in range already. Well, he held out, didn't he? Seriously, did he? He broke a unit of cuirassiers. We've never been able to do that. Or well, I don't remember being able to do it. Ah, that was most unexpected. I wonder if I can... In the position. We can flank them. Right, they have gone for a charge over here. And that's Dragoons. Let's have a look at them. Do you like their uniforms? Keep fighting men! Right, is that the rest of our cav? It is. Now they've got a lot of artillery to bring in. And of course it will come in relatively slowly. Right. There's those Contra Gorillas out there. Ready to shoot. Now yeah, I do want to pick off the artillery if we have the opportunity. We should be able to knock off this unit. I do see some artillery firing. Let's divert somebody after them. That's going to be lots of cavalry. Hmm. Yeah, they got more cuirassiers in here, and they got artillery hiding back there. Right, you managed to get in. Ooh, you're going to have to deal with those cuirassiers. Keep moving. Right, you should have taken care of all of them. Right, get through there and then try to get to the artillery. I think this French army has been sitting here since the beginning of the campaign. Oh, I told you to go right through there. Yeah, that's that cavalry. Right, still got two units. I thought I told those two to move. Obviously not. You don't really have a good route through there. Because there's still a lot of cavalry back there. Hmm. Did you get through? You did, didn't you? Go get them. No, oh, you're making this difficult. <coughs> You're making it difficult on yourselves. Alright, no one's gone. Not completely. But it has been wiped out. Still having trouble killing them all off. Nope, here comes a big charge. Right, looks like they were just pushing right through here. With their um, cavalry. Hmm. Yeah, they're keeping a lot. Oh, they actually deployed stakes back there as well. And they're keeping a lot of units back there. All oh, those ones are about to go into melee. Our men are running, sir. 
Yeah, they broke through both of those. See, now very quick to react, aren't they? Very quick. Hmm. Right. Uh, that one's just gone. That one just went. Right. We'll have to put those into square as well. Doesn't look like anyone's rallying. So this is the end of October, so we've basically got four turns left now. Hmm, if we didn't have this big battle, I might have just made this episode long enough so we can get through it. Um, this is another defeat for myself. Nobody rallying? Nope. Yeah, everybody's running. They like to run. Look to do a lot of running. There goes my general. Nope. Get into melee mode. Keep firing. Looks like they might even break the square. Nobody has rallied except for this one. Hmm, they could form a very small square. Ah, oh, looks like you actually held them off. Right, break out. Break out. Break out. That one might hold. Oh, I told you to break out. Yeah, they've taken out everything over there. Now you did hold off that cavalry. And so did you. Almost looked like those were going into square. Alright. Bayonet them. Might as well. We've only got three active units for the time being. Not moving very quickly. It's because you were walking. I know I tell you to walk, not run, because it's dangerous, but sometimes you should run when I tell you. Ah, second one has rallied. They're actually facing the wrong way. Yay! Oh, wait. Oh, there goes a Dragoon charge in there. Up oh, down to two units, and then it's all over. Yep. Oh. Somebody rallied out there. They're going to have the range, so we might as well charge them. Oh, you actually managed to break that unit. Fire on them. This one might break before they make contact oh no one's rallied well we're not going to get a victory there's more troops coming in lots of artillery out there but um, yeah we actually managed to hold that one off Uh, then they do a more break at the same time. Well, that's pretty much it. Hmm. 
Well, we killed 1370. We did try. We did try. Hmm. Alright. Yeah, they managed to get back to this one. I was hoping to get there, but we lost two little armies in the last episode. And we got about half as many men. Um, oh, come on, seriously? You did not have that much movement points. Hmm. Well, I bet if I played a British campaign I could win. I bet you. <laughs> I did win very easily the um, Italian campaign. I forget which difficulty I put that on, but that was very easy. Something like six episodes. I've played that one quite a few times since Napoleon came out and never done that well. I mean, I've pretty much always won it in uh, personal campaigns, but never in six episodes. I swear it was six episodes. I'll go back and look. At worst, it was eight. But honestly, I think it was six. I don't even know if we have any other troops that we could send. Um, once we finish this battle. Looks like we're not going to get to use our elite units like our grenadiers and our Walloon guards. Which is a shame. We have met the enemy. Most of this campaign, our morale has been a lot lower than the enemy's. And that really does affect a lot of things in Total War. I mean, peasants with very high morale can easily beat uh, militia spearmen, even uh, dismounted foot knights on occasions in Medieval 2. And in this one, uh, whenever we've sacked a settlement, our morale has actually gone down on our units we've had negative morale on units believe it or not I didn't even realize that was a thing but it actually is negative morale I saw units with zero morale and then I saw units with minus one morale that's scary bad all hope is lost sir. this battle is almost done yep it ain't going well, mate. Still, we are killing Frenchies. Keep killing, keep killing, as long as you can. Oh, there you go. Alright. I don't think anyone's going to survive, but you never know. You never know. Nope, they took them all out. Hmm. Right, we've got 5,200 in coins now. Which is a lot. Right. Visit. Because you always lose. Right, we actually might be able to have held on there. Half blocked. Right, uh, they've consolidated their forces there. Hmm. No, I just wanted to put them under siege. Right. Um, surprisingly, they've fielded a lot of militia units. 1,516. Right, they do outnumber us. Yeah. 
what do we have coming there an extra two units we also have troops coming from there uh, uh, where do we go with these now that we're down to just a few turns Yeah, don't worry about them. Right, you bumped into our allies. Hmm, how happy is this one? Might exempt them. I would have said send them all up here. Because that'll take three turns to get there. Ah, oh, we can get all of our gorilla units up there. Right, is that one of mine? No, Portuguese. Portuguese. That's one of mine. Oh, we lost again. What's the trick for upgrading those? Because they always seem to lose. No, oh, that's odd. We managed to get up there, but we couldn't get back. We inflicted some damage, but now we're going to replenish and they keep recruiting up there, don't they? Right. Let's see what's up here waiting for us. Probably a full stack. Oh, there's somebody up there. Can you get all the way up there? actually besiege them no you can't that's the wing all right keep going keep going is that one of mine no nope. all right where did I even recruit units O and one O and one O and four Hmm there's some units Thing is, even our line infantry are going to take two turns, and uh, we've only got four left. Four turns left. We've got four units coming from there. Finally got some money and can't really do too much with it now. There's the Crassiers, they'll take four turns. <laughs> There's my Walloon guards. We got enough money for another line infantry act. Oh, he was going up there. I've forgotten about him. Well, I've forgotten about him as well. Alright, France. Hmm, 524 versus 600. 
Uh, we've got two cavalry. We could take them out. Ah, oh, they've only got three morale. Normally they have a lot more than that, don't they? Three morale. We would actually beat them. Yeah, if we could get rid of them. Get some charges in. I think I could win that. It's very close. Very close. Alright, that's where we'll end this episode.